Nigerian light, the only segment of the Nigerian society that have developed and mastered a weaponry against the citizens such that they have, they have, you know, they have indoctrinated them with poverty. Web, you know, they have so indoctrinated their senses with poverty. They have used poverty, seeking conditions situation to take them, to cajole them, to hook them, to you know, suppress, suppress them. them. So when they bring a, a, a mega little thing out, oh, it trickles people's mind of running for survival, not for not to grab for survival. Because that was the next thing. They make sure they use weapon of poverty. To, to 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 make sure they use it to to indoctrinate people's ideology and everything. That is why when somebody just come and say it's contesting, on an anchor ship, you see people struggling. I saw hello, people went for campaign, ladies, in my area. When they came back, they, they put on cap, they put anchor ship. And I, I, yes, okay, yes. No, I don't. It's a woman. I cannot see what they wear. I think I can see cap on their head. I see a ship in, in their hands. And I told them, I, I said, what did you bring for the from your campaign? Eh, so they give us face cap, they give us anchor ship, and they give us vest. Of course, I know I cannot ask them. We are missing because they are women. They must have worn down that way. And I told one of them. I said, so since money you've been dancing around, since money, since money you've been dancing around in the name of campaign, you only came home with car, uh, anchor ship. I said, what says? Uh, what was that? Hey, they gave they, they gave them one thousand naira. Not all of them. They will, they will say some of them. So that they were not able to get down to that. And I said, I said, quantify the cost of the first cap, the anchorship, and the 1,000. I said, I'm on this amount too. Of course, I'm not your, your party, your position anyway. You left your job since money. They gave me 1,000. I said, maybe I know many of you did not even win this. They didn't get, they, they, so they have used web poverty to, to strike people so that any little thing, people will run now for, to grab me for survival. And that would have been using. So don't say masses could not uh, uh, rise up. Let me tell you one thing. In my region, I, I, I tell you anything. Our regional overseer, in one house of rep uh, slot in the Ubadon, he did the final Thanksgiving yesterday in our church. He now said something. You know, it's not, it's not representing Lagos, it's representing you by the way. It's a minister in MFM in Lagos. He now told us something. He said they gave me 100 slots at another level for his constituency. He said because he's a pastor in Lagos Church, of course, all of us pray for him. He said we'll give, I'm, I'm, this is a private information I'm, I'm giving out. I'm talking, I'm talking about yesterday, matter. He said we'll give five to the church in Lagos, the remaining 95 to his uh, constituency. I can assure you that the so-called 100 slots, if you see the number of people that will contest for it in that uh, local government, and that uh, constituency where it comes from, now the five slots it gets to the region here now. Do you know about parties that make up a region here? Do you know about, do you know about house fellowship that? You can see the way people will scramble for it. They will desperately find their last strength. Because poverty has been used to weaponize people. They have so much to set people's mind with poverty and everything. People, they, they make sure that... It's still a decay. They make sure that... People could not I miss you overtly. You don't miss me overtly. They have, <laughs> they have, they have, they have considered you every you area. I miss you overtly. They have, they have shinked every, they have shinked every place, every place where yeah, people could make use of their opportunity, their brain, everything. And there's no environment, there's no environment for people to thrive, to do anything. There's encouragement in everything. I was hearing one, I was hearing one debate on, on OGTV. They compare UK education to Nigeria education. Why? Because this new bill for granting loan to students, that Tunumu just signed to law. No, not just signed a law now. We just signed a law that granted loan to Nigeria students. That is the law. Now that is that. Where they are comparing what is applicable in UK, the the demands of professors, education is to go and compare what is already going on in UK with what Tunumu just signed. How is this program 
compare with UK. Do you know ours is more of slavery compared to what is being enjoyed in the UK? Of course, it's not more of this. Where they analyze this? I lost interest. So they don't. So they are. They are they, they, that's why that's why masses were unable to rise up and do anything. It's not that people are it's not that people are, 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 no, are taking a turn or they are, they are timid. I agree with you because it's just like certain hand to give somebody something. But raising it far above his uh accessibility. Huh? And the condition said nobody can meet it. How can you get at uh, level twelve? Your papa don't work for civil servant before, or your uncle. Where you go go you go to where? Alausa. Alausa. <laughs>